1. Opacity Vibrations Duplicate your clip. Change the opacity of the highest clip to 50. Now move this clip to create the effect. You can fade it in to make it smooth. And here you go with the effect. 2. Blending Modes Duplicate your clip and trim it to the part where you want to add the effect. If you select the clip, you can choose different composite modes. I'm going to take Add. This mode blends two clips. I'm going to make it a little bit shorter. It looks like this now. Add a fade in and fade out. Now we have this result. 3. Flashes. Create a solid. Change the color to white. Now we are going to play some cuts on the solid clip. The more flashes you want, the more cuts you need. Eventually delete some to create the effect. Here we have them, the flashes. 4. The color warper. The purple light that you saw wasn't in the recording. Duplicate the clip and go to the color grading. Make sure that you stand on the highest clip in the timeline and that you're in the color warper section. By dragging the center point you can add a color. I'm going to take purple. Let's trim it and add a fade in. It gives this result. Let's trim the end and add a fade out. Now it looks like a purple light is in the atmosphere. 5. Fusion Transitions These are transitions that are built inside DaVinci Resolve. You can find them in the toolbox under Video Transitions. Transitions are tools that you can use when two clips are placed next to each other. I'm going to play some cuts in one clip so that I can add the fusion transitions there. This way, I can show some of my favorites. By dragging, you can change the duration of the transition. I'm going to add some transitions first. Let's make some of them shorter in duration. Some fusion transitions are only available in the paid version, but most of them aren't. You can play around with them. This is the last one that I'm going to add. Here you go, the fusion transitions. 6. Light Rays This is the clip without the effect. Search in the open effects for light rays. Drag it to the clip. Nothing changed. Decrease the source threshold. As you can see, the light rays are added. This is without and this is with. It already looks cool enough to me. You can test out all the settings in this effect. But I'm satisfied with this effect. 7. Blending different clips. The band consists of 4 members, so I have all of them on top of each other in the same length. This is the first clip. This is the second clip. This is the third clip. This is the fourth clip. It would be nice to blend them all. Go to Composite and choose a blend mode. I'm going to take Add for them all. The lowest clip isn't necessary, as this is already visible. That means that we're ready. 